In this video we will have a look at the modifier stack of both body and skirt. Tell something about parenting the skirt, the skirt mesh to the rig and show how the skirt will behave in cloth simulation. But first I want to mention why solidifying the skirt is so important. In order for the body to see and collide with the skirt, it needs skirt normals pointing towards the body. Also for a realistic view of the rims and insides of the skirt, this solidified modifier uh, which was applied and therefore does not show up in the stack is important. Now we look at the modifier stack of the, of the body. When parenting the, uh, the body to the rig, automatically gen Blender generates an armature modifier. We left all the parameters in the default mode. In the second position there is a subsurf modifier. Um, which I changed to view is one and I don't think I changed anything other a part of that. In the third place there's a collision modifier which tells the body that it takes part in the collision. The order of the modifiers on the stack is rather important, so that's why I'm mentioning this. Next we look at the skirt modifier stack. Again in the first position we find the armature modifier and we accept, accepted the default values. We have experimented a bit with preserved volume, but this did not did not give good enough results, so we switched that off. Second is the collision modifier, and finally the class modifier. A bit about parenting the skirt. I tried all kinds of parenting which did not work. And finally what did work was using armature deformed with empty groups, so I stick to that. Now let's look at the timeline. You will notice that there are now 37 frames instead of the original 26 of our walk cycle. And I moved the whole walk cycle up 12 frames and the walk cycle now starts with a passing position and I added the walk cycle frames bef before that at the end. I'll tell you why. The body at the start of the walk cycle is at quite a distance from the rest position. This is the, the first position, almost the rest position, and this is the, the starting of the walk cycle. Cloth simulation is about behavior of cloth in time. If, if we have big jumps in location on the timeline, also, the skirt has to move big time, and it does, that is, without taking meshes. The frames that I inserted before frame 12 are therefore intended to obtain a very gradual move and bridge the gap between the rest position and the start of the walk cycle proper.
I did not want to waste your time, so I have already baked the simulation. Let me tell you that the simulation was done at about 25, um, excuse me, um, point 25 frames per second. And so it took about 37 times uh, 4 seconds um, to do the simulation. You see in the physics tab in the properties window that both collision and close are activated. As a close preset I chose denim. I think only increased the, the damping parameter spring um, to, to its maximum. The settings are grayed out because the simulation has been baked. It is interesting to note here the, the close collision settings. They are all set to the minimum. Remember that in the next section. Now let us look at the behavior of the skirt in simulation. For that we'll go to the front view. And we'll start at frame zero. Simulation always starts at frame one and will only take effect from frame two. Look what happens when we go from frame 1 to 2. You see with the, at the rim of the skirt it is pushed outward by Blender. Even though all the, param the repulsion parameters are set to the minimum. Obviously, the simulation was not designed with this application in mind. But how I wish it was, because it would save a lot of work. Let us look what happens next, the rest of the simulation. We'll give all A. You see first the approach of the walk cycle which looks at a bit of a wriggling and then the proper walk cycle is cycled through. With a skirt this wide we would not expect to see holes in the mesh in front but also in the back and you can see both are okay. In the next video we will show what I've done to get a better fit of the skirt.